cue to get dressed for the day. <laughs> Say hi guys. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. I thought I would vlog another day in my life as a stay-at-home mom. I already did my makeup today during his first nap. I didn't film any of that because once I get him down for his first nap, I like hurry to try and just go get ready because you never know if it's gonna be a 30 minute nap or like an hour nap or whatever. It was a 30 nap, it was a 30 minute nap today. So I got my makeup done. Obviously I'm not dressed yet, but yeah, I thought I'd vlog. I plan on going to Trader Joe's later with my mom. Um, not sure what else I have planned for the day, but that's what's going on. So I'm gonna go ahead and get myself dressed and then we're gonna go get him dressed for the day and yeah okay you just want to be held that's okay that's okay that's okay you got a lot to tell them is that what it is you got a lot to say we have a really chatty baby in the background <laughs> Which is fine, um, but I'm gonna get dressed. I feel like as a mom now, my style includes comfort, functional, cute. I actually found the cutest pieces that fit all of those requirements for me um, from Halara. They have the cutest workout dresses ever, and I love workout dresses right now. They're my favorite thing to wear. Um, Functional, cute, comfortable. It's a million degrees outside right now, so they keep me cool while also being able to like move. I can breastfeed most in most of them. Um, bless you. Bless you, bless you, bless you, bless you, bless you. He's in his bouncer on the floor, by the way. You can't see him, but he's down there. Got some really cute pieces from Halara that is actually the sponsor of today's video. So thank you, Halara, for sponsoring today's video. I'm obsessed with the items that I received. I have already worn this one dress. It's actually my dirty laundry. I need to go grab it to show you. Um, I've worn it twice. I'm obsessed with it. It's so cute, flattering, functional. I can breastfeed him in it, which is really important to me. I'm finding that. Bless you. <laughs> I'm finding that finding clothes now can be kind of difficult because I have to remember that I need to be able to breastfeed in them. And some things you cannot do that. And I figured that out. And I'm like, oh, I love the stuff that I got. I'm going to show you guys what I got, try it on for you, and we'll see what I'll wear today. This is the one I'm talking about. Just pulled it out of my laundry hamper. It's just a black dress. I'll try it on for you guys. It's so flattering and so cute. I'm obsessed with it. So here's this one on. Like I said, it's my favorite. I'm obsessed with it. It's just so flattering, so stretchy, so comfortable. I think it's really, really flattering. It has the built-in shorts that also have pockets, which is really nice for your phone or for whatever. But like I said, it like opens up back here so you can just pull it down to go to the restroom, which is so nice because I love wearing rompers and stuff like this, but having to strip down naked in a public restroom, not the vibe. I'm gonna buy more colors. What color do you think I should buy? 
white hot pink light pink light blue like navy they have every color and i don't know what i want but i need to get another one of these because it's my favorite this one is this really pretty blue color and it's a different style i'm gonna go ahead and try it on to show you it has the cutest bag ever let me try it on no okay Here's this next one, also so flattering and so cute. I love this color. I really like the neckline like with the thicker straps and like, I don't know, I think it's really flattering. It's got a seam here and it kind of is a flowier skirt. Again, it has built-in shorts. So don't pull down in the back, which is a little sad um, because I love the feature of that last one. But this one is so, so stinking cute. I love the back, that's the best part. It's like business in the front party in the back look how cute the back is so yeah this is this one and i also got the same style in white which is super cute i'll try that one on next for you guys okay here's the white one i love white i think it's so so stinking cute we're super cute back again shorts are built in with a pocket which is really nice um yeah not much else to say about this dress besides i love it except I am going to be honest with you, white is risky these days because this guy has a blowout all the time. He just pooped and I hope he didn't have a blowout, but y'all help me out. Like, is it the diapers? I've tried different diapers. I've sized him up in diapers. Oh, he has blowouts all the time. Um, but super cute besides the fact that it's dangerous to wear this wide of an outfit with a baby because... Stuff happens, if you know what I mean. And last dress that I have, it's like this light blue color and it just makes me feel like a little ballerina. I'm gonna try this one on. Here is the last dress that I got from Halara. So cute, such a pretty color, such a like unique design. I think the little skirt on this one is so cute. It's like a little ballerina skirt. It has this really flattering like V seam, which I think really, I don't know, flatters you. The back is again so cute. All of these have such cute backs. The built-in shorts, the pockets on this side, um, which I love. So that is all I got from Halara. Yeah, I have been loving all of these. I'm gonna put that dark blue one back on because I think that's the one I'm gonna go with today. Do you guys remember what I said about blowouts? <laughs> this is why we're not wearing white. Say, this is why we're not gonna wear white, huh? You pooped everywhere. Come, I cleaned every time. What do you wanna wear today? What do you want to wear? Never used to know about love. But I didn't tell you that I didn't so today. That's so much when it came to open my heart. Baby. Until you found a way to knock down every wall I kept all around. Oh, you came, you saw, you conquered. Being loved by using honor. And if I ever lose you now, I'll be losing myself too. I will never put you down. All my heart hopes you never do. And if the world ain't So I just got Cohen down for a nap, much needed. I wasn't paying attention and I got way past his wake window on accident. Um, he got a little overtired and was fussy, um, but I was able to get him down for a nap. I calmed him down and then I nursed him a little bit and I got him down for his nap. So he's napping, but I wanted to mention to you guys that Halara, you can get 15% off of any of these items on Halara's website, definitely check it out. They have super affordable pipe prices to begin with, but then an additional 15% off is a win. I'm about to go purchase that black dress, but in a different color because I'm obsessed with it. Um, definitely check it out. You guys can use my link or you can use the code Olivia15 for 15% off of your order. Definitely go check it out. I'm loving all of my Halara pieces and I know you guys will too. Now that he's napping, I'm gonna try to go find something to eat. I have like no groceries, but I'm gonna try to find something to eat and I'm gonna finish my coffee because that's been sitting. Um, but 
yeah he is napping a little angel boy i get so sad when he gets upset it was totally my fault for letting him get overtired like way past his wake time i was like when i noticed it was like 11 02 and i was like he should have been already down for a nap already because i normally try to get him down like at the like at hour when he's been awake for an hour and 15 minutes i start to get him like in his little nap routine we get it dark we put a sleep sack on get him changed comfy rock him kiss him down in the crib pass fire sleep so he's down sleeping by like the hour and a half mark but i realized we were past the hour and a half mark before any of that so i got him all ready but then he was overtired and got a little cranky which my fault i was like no um so i rocked him i nursed him calmed them all down and got him down so he's taking a nap i don't know if it'll be a long one but at least he's sleeping and we'll get a little bit of rest okay like i said i'm gonna go see if i can find something to eat and drink my coffee that i made this morning i have no food so cereal it is <laughs> Bon appetit. Here's the setup. I'm gonna eat my cereal, drink my coffee, hang out. I'm not sure if this will be a great nap because he keeps dropping his passy, um, which normally he doesn't care about, but I don't think he's in a very deep sleep yet, so yeah. Someone's awake. He slept for like 40 minutes, so that's pretty good. <laughs> Did you take a nap? Did you take a little nap? Do you feel better? Do you feel better? Yeah. I love you. I love you. I love you so I love you so much. Love you more the more the days pass by. I love you. If I ever lose you now, I'd be losing myself too. I won't ever put you down. All my heart hopes you never do. If the world ain't clear tonight, <laughs> okay, my other camera started to die or was dying, so I switched cameras. I don't know why the who was gonna tell me my bronzer looked that intense anyways that camera dies so quickly so I'm on my other camera we are just playing he just ate um yeah now we're just hanging out playing on the floor we're gonna probably read some books do tummy time all that fun stuff so yeah My other camera died, so different camera, but we are just playing. He just ate my hair, y'all. Help. Help! My hair is not, not it today, but we are just playing, doing some floor time. Probably gonna read some books during tummy time. Um, we've got Pika, Pika Flap Who. If you give a mouse a cookie, that's a classic. I remember that book from when I was in like elementary school. So that's what's going on. We're just hanging out and playing. Pika flat boys to be somebody new. Joe is hot to me. Okay, so now my SD card ran out of storage, so we are on my phone. We read our book, back to playing like this. Yes, um, but now we're just filming on my phone because what the heck. <laughs> hey, bud. Oakley. <laughs> what you doing, buddy? Good job, Bob. You're so strong. 
awesome. Good job, baby. <laughs> okay, so complete outfit change, hair change, everything change because one, spit up in a dark color, don't don't go together. <laughs> um, also, my hair is driving me absolutely nuts today. It just looks so bad. I washed it like two days ago, so it's not super clean, but it just feels disgusting and I just can't get it to look cute. So <laughs> he is ready for another nap. So I'm just carrying him in the carrier. I've been loving this carrier though. It's so stinking cute. It's from, I don't know how to say it, so I'll just put it on the screen, um, but I've been loving that this carrier but i just changed into some jean shorts and a little top um i go through outfit changes like he does throughout the day so yeah but i'm gonna take a break on filming for today until i'm doing something interesting because i feel like right now there's just not anything going on it's just like hanging out at home basically until my mom comes over and we go to trader joe's um but yeah, my hair is like, actually, I just want to shave my head right now. <laughs> just kidding. But it's driving me nuts. So yeah, I'm going to take a break of filming right now and just hang out. And then I'll film. I will film when I'm doing something more interesting because right now I'm just like. <sighs> okay. I'll see y'all later. You make me sick. You can never love. Someone until you love yourself the way you love me. I don't get tired of We are in the car headed to Trader Joe's. My mom had to stop at a store really quickly. She's in there. Um but yeah, thought I'd update you guys. I got Starbucks, got a little sandwich, but we are on our way to Trader Joe's. I don't live near a Trader Joe's at all. I'm gonna get back there, but back home now obviously um we went to Trader Joe's Cohen slept basically the entire time we were in Trader Joe's and also all the way home pretty much almost home and so when we got here he was like feed me um so I just fed him and now I'm gonna give you guys a little Trader Joe's haul before I end this video because it's the end of the day it's almost eight o'clock um so yeah I'm gonna give you guys a little haul of everything I got from Trader Joe's so I, first of all, I got two of these little breakfast burritos because I really need to find better options for breakfast. So I get so bored of just eggs. He's super talkative and happy now that he's fed. Um, I got some eggs, speaking of, because I ran out. Let's see. I got this gnocchi. It's like, this stuff's so good. I love gnocchi. Gnocchi, gnocchi. I don't know how to say it. Um, I got this chicken breast parmesan. I might make this tonight for dinner because it's gonna be a late one. Bradley is still not off of work. Got more gnocchi. This one's like stuffed with marinara and stuff. Um, I got these s'mores bars I've seen on TikTok. Also, this is probably like reversed, so I apologize because I'm still filming on my phone just because I never cleared storage on my SD card. I got some of these chicken sausage, breakfast sausages. Got some cheese tortellini. I got, what is this? Some cheese curds. I got some milk. Got some mac and cheese. Ground chicken. 
a couple of these for Bradley. They're just um, salami and cheese little packets to bring to work. And then I got these to try their egg bites, like the Starbucks ones. So I got these croissants to make like a sandwich with the sausage and an egg and cheese. I think that'd be so good. Got some JoJo's, some Turjo Oreos. I got these chips. These are the best chips ever. Um, I haven't had them in a really long time, but I love these. So probably snack on those later tonight. I got Bradley these disgusting <laughs> chocolate covered like berry things. He's an old man and likes that. I got these tiny cookies cause I was intrigued. And I also got some noodles, some just spaghetti. I also got these like granola bites. I've already eaten one, pretty good. So that's my little Trader Joe's haul. I also bought flowers there. Just, I have to make a bouquet still. I'm not gonna do that right now though. I'm gonna put all this stuff away and then It'll be time to give Cohen a bath and start his bedtime routine. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'm gonna end it here though, just because I'm gonna film a bedtime routine separately for a whole other video, I think. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed spending the day with me and my baby boy, Cohen. Uh, make sure to subscribe if you are new and I will see you guys in the next video. I'm gonna put all my groceries away and then probably get the bath ready for him. So yeah, I love you guys. I'll see you in the next video. Bye. <laughs>